Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nick. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back. I've been waiting for today. Today we are getting into a movie that I don't know what the plot is, other than the fact that it's a slasher film. People are all like, oh my God, you need to watch it. This is Ty West's new film. And I'm like, who the fuck is Ty West? And they're like, oh my God, House of the Devil. And I'm like, what is that? But and th that's on my list. It's on my list to watch. But the interwebs has been blowing the fuck up with hype about this movie, saying that it's one of the best slasher films in like decades. So today we are getting into the brand new film, X. <laughs> what do I know about X? I know that Jenna Ortega is in it, that there's a girl with no eyebrows named Mia Goth and she's in it. I think I heard that Britney Snow is in it. Other than that, it's a slasher film that like happens or something like when they're like filming a porn tow movie or something like I, I, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I've been successful up until this point at avoiding all spoilers about the movie. Everybody's been like, you need to see X, you need to see X. It's like the greatest thing since sliced bread. You need to see X. So I'm gonna see X. Before we get into the movie, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button to get notifications for when I upload a new video. Feel free to check me out on social media. I have both Instagram, I have Twitter, whatever tickles your pickle. Also make sure to check out my Patreon. You'll get access to full length audio commentaries, polls to help me pick what I watch next and more. I hope it's scary, I hope it's sexy. And where I'm at right now, like the wind is going crazy. My entire fucking apartment is just creaking like one more huff from the wolf and this whole bitch is just gonna blow them right the down. Like look up at the gods, let's look up at the powers that be and just hope that my ceiling doesn't collapse on me while I'm watching this. This is X. Is this, this looks like the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. What the fuck is this? Oh shit. Well, it may not be the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Actually, actually no, look at this, look at this. Is, do, do all like homes in Texas just look like this? Cause this, ooh, ooh, no. Every single time I see a movie about Texas, people are just getting slaughtered. Here, you ought to come take a look at this. What is it? I'm assuming this is gonna be something that we're gonna see later on in the film. Oh no. Who's sniffing the coca cocaine? You're special. There ain't nobody else out there like you. Now giddy up. Did they say what year this takes place in? I'm just curious, cause she's kind of got like, like a little bit of like 80s, 70s eye shadow, or not eye shadow. I don't, I don't know, I don't wear makeup. You know what I'm talking about, the blue, the blue. You're a fucking sex symbol. Do you think she knows where her eyebrows went? I mean, I ain't complaining. I love a no eyebrow look, but I'm just curious as to, I don't know anything about Mia Goth, so I don't know if like, that's how she always looks or if it was specifically done for this movie, if it was a creative choice. Ooh, is that Britney Snow? I'm surprised such a small movie like this was able to secure Britney Snow after she was in that, you know, Oscar nominated remake of Prom Night. I do love me some Britney Snow though. I wonder if that's a green screen. Ooh, 1979. Now I know what year it is. I just want a paper house, a big old pool, so I can float around with my knees in the breeze and tan these titties. Is the guy with the long hair, Is he reminds me of um, the guy from the Evil Dead remake. I can't think of his name, but like the, the guy that ends up reading from the fucking Necronomicon and destroying everything. What's your American dream? She's got like freckles on one side of her face and I wonder if that's makeup or if that's like actually her freckles. Either way, it looks really, really cool. Gas was 65 cents a gallon in 1979. Oh my God, I need a fucking time machine because this $4 a gallon shit. <laughs> well, you help me keep those jokers in line out there. I'll make sure you get everything your heart desires. I want the whole world to know my name. Like Linda Carter or some shit. <gasps> Linda Carter, the OG Wonder Woman. Linda Car oh, 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 Linda Carter was that bitch. Your little boyfriend's cute. You help him with all his films? Sometimes, yeah. <gasps> Jenna Ortega. Wait, was she, has she been in like the frame the whole time? Was she in the car? I don't even remember seeing her. But yay, Jenna Ortega. All right, go ahead and fill her up. You know, if you tilt the camera up from the nozzle, it'll look like he's using his cock. <laughs> They're thinking about it like, oh, it's kind of a good idea. <laughs> 
Look, and they're playing the porn tell music too. <laughs> Ooh. Besides, ain't exactly something I want to advertise around town. You know how some people can get when it comes to sex. What? He doesn't want to advertise that they're making a porn show around town, but then he's going to stand in front of the, the cashier and just openly talk about it? <laughs> yeah, that'll keep it a secret. Fucking idiot. Winston, you know I only smoke old gold. All they had, Bobby Lynn. That's it! <laughs> It says plowing service on the van. On the notes. Be bad wreck. Ugh. Oh, oh, not the cow. Oof. I hate letting go. Oh, why? What? So this is it. Our own studio backlog. Thank goodness, I'm horny. Oh, it's horny. The thing that they drove under, all that needed was the sign that says Camp Crystal Lake. It looks identical. No. No. I mean, this literally looks like the site of, 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 of multiple murders. Uh, Who's that? Yes, sir. It's Wayne Gilroy. We spoke on the telephone. I'm here to film a porn tow on your property, sir. You're just a little cunnilingus. Ain't a lingus. Pretty much the full spectrum of lingus. We spoke on Tuesday about y'all's boarding house. That's right. You're looking for a place to stay. Absolutely not. I mean, I get that they want to make the porn tell, but they're like, ugh. You show up and the motherfucker shoot, like, points a gun at you and go, oh, sorry, miscommunicate. No, get the fuck out. What is that? Who is that? Is that the, is that the, the owner guy? Ugh, no, 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 no. See, the guy that owns the house looks like a mixture of, like, um, Grandpa from Texas Chainsaw Massacre and the fucking Crypt Keeper. See, I'm a kind person, I'm a nice person, but if I rolled up on somebody's property and they looked like that, no, no. You all right there, old timer? I'm fine. Is there a reason why they're not showing his face? Also, another random thing that I've noticed so far is that, like, the shots, they're, they're, they're taking their time with how long the shots are, and they're showing, like, how big, like, the distance is between, like, point A to point B, like, how secluded they are. I, I, I don't know if that's just establishing shots to display how isolated they are, or if there's a specific, like, story-centric purpose that they're showing that, like, if that's gonna come into play later on. Oh, Dan, that's my future fiance. Hey, you're eyeballing there. Been a while since you've seen anything that nice. Ugh. I don't think I like you, Wayne. Eh? I don't much like the looks of none of y'all. And my wife is next door, so I would appreciate a little discretion. <sighs> yeah, yeah. I mean, legitimately, all the fucking signs have been presented to leave. So if y'all choose to say, Peace. He don't know what we're doing, does he? He sure doesn't. Well, it's better to beg for forgiveness and ask for permission. He doesn't know? The, the owner doesn't? Oh my god. Just warning sign after warning sign. <laughs> this is the porn tell that they thought was going to make them millions of dollars? Ooh, I love this look that she's got going on. Just nothing but the, but the overalls. It's a look. It's a pretty shot. Again, displaying like the expansiveness of the location and the shot and, and, and it's big. That's what she said. <laughs> Who is that now? Is that the wife? Cause he said the wife was next door. I bet that's the wife. Girl, look behind you, behind you. Look behind. Look behind you. People's eyes are gonna pop out of their damn skulls when they see this. We're gonna be rich. Feel how hard my cock is. Ha! Gay! Is that what I think it... Ew! This is disgusting. I like it though. I wanna watch it again. She's about to, oh my God. There is an alligator in the water with her. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? You just like look behind you and there's a fucking alligator coming at you. Ow! Get out of the water, get out of the water, get out of the water, please get out of the water. Oh, that's gross. My daddy will be home soon and I'm sure he could give you a lift to town. Would you like to come inside? <laughs> I bet he would. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, what? Oh no, 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 no. That She looks dead. Like... No, no, no. Now I'm gonna pass on that one. She's not about to go up in this house, is she? Really? What is it with people just like randomly walking into fucking people's homes? Like you don't go into somebody's house unless they say, come in. She just went into their house. She just went into their house. Also, like, why? Why is she just randomly going into this house? Like, for what? Is this all because she saw the geriatric mummy on the porch waving at her? Like, what? No, no. See, if you see, like, if you if you end up seeing some furniture made out of bones, you need to dip. Actually, you should probably dip now, but, you know. Who? Oh, no. What was that? Yeah, she looks dead. Like, she's sitting up, looking around, but the bitch looks dead. You in danger, girl. I was young once, too. About 200 years ago. Such a special face. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Does she have eyes? Oh no. Ugh. She's weak. Ugh. I don't like this old lady. She's making me uncomfortable. What are you doing? Giggity, 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 giggity. Ew. No. Don't like that. It will be our secret. What? Look at the same oh. cheekbones oh. and the same lip. They've got the same nose. <laughs> tickle, tickle. Beep, boop. Like, is this seriously not just setting off red flags for people? I mean, I get they're all horny, but I ain't never been that horny. No, 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 no. Watch out! <laughs> She needs to chill out on the coca cane, man. Oh shit. She left the lemonade out. And the woman was like, it'll be our little secret. So, ooh, some shit's about to go down. Um, what is going on? This is straight up Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> Is Miss Jenna getting turned on? Hmm? Oh no, oh no. Oh, the fucking old corpse is looking in from the window. Ooh. Oh, she put on the eye makeup like, like, uh. uh. Oh! What the f That's weird. But anyways, as what I was saying, she put on the, the blue eye shadow like Mia Goth had. And when she was talking to her about when she when they were having a lemonade, like the the mirror the scenes were like being mirrored, like what Britney Snow's character was doing when she was filming her porno, and then what Mia Goth was doing with drinking the lemonade when she was talking to the Crypt Keeper. Interesting. I don't know what it means. We talked about this. Please. You know I can't. My heart. She wanted to have sex? Are they are the old people gonna kill everybody because they're mad because they can't have sex anymore? Ain't nobody ever teach you not to stare? It's rude. You got something to say to me or what? No. I have a feeling like Jenna Ortega's character is a lesbian. Or maybe she wants to film porn too, I don't know. Letting outdated traditions control how you live your life will get you nowhere. I ain't into that. I mean, yeah, be free. Bone who you want to bone. Do what you want to do. Love who you want to love. Everybody likes sex. But we're just not afraid to admit it. You know why? Because one day, we're gonna be too old to fuck. Yeah, like them two old biddies in the house. I've fallen and I can't get up. I don't know if I agree with all of that, but I did like what I saw today. I think I would, but I did. Cheers to that. Come through, Miss Jenna. Oh God, they're gonna kill her. Well, at least she survived Scream 5. I wanna do a scene in a movie. Uh, what? <laughs> what? I want to be in the movie. She saw two scenes getting filmed and now she wants to get dicked down. <laughs> no. Did y'all put her up to this or something? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, weren't, weren't you just sitting there talking about the freedom of sexual expression and, and f***ing who you want and now your, your own girlfriend can't do it? Yeah, I got you. I got you on camera. If we really are making a good, dirty movie, I don't want to just carry the equipment. I want to be in it. Well, you can't. Ooh, I hope he dies first. Nobody's coming to see this film for the plot. They're coming to see tits and ass and a big dick. It's all right. <laughs> She's got a point. When did you become such a prude? All right, hold on. Burn, she just burnt the f out of him. Yeah, yeah. 
Well, she's going to do it whether you like it or not. She's going to go on to do it with God knows how many people and God knows how many other films. Nobody wants that. I mean, if she wants to, if she wants to become Miss Porto Queen of Texas, let her. Ooh, she looks, uh, she looks stunning. <laughs> Look, she took off the crotch. She's like, I can't have Jesus watching me right now. <laughs> Her panties said Sunday. Have we confirmed what day of the week it is? Why is he crying? All because she was in the porn toe? Oh, the hell with this, she can have it. Let's see how far they get without me. He's a dick. He's about to steal the fucking van all because he's mad because his girlfriend decided to be in the porn toe. No. No, bitch. And they're playing fucking Don't Fear the Reaper on the radio. This is a sign. Leave. Are you all right? Does she look all right? That she fucking looks like Deborah Logan. Ugh, she's about to eat his head. Why would you look at me? <laughs> I can show you what I'm capable of. Stop, I, I, I don't want to see. No, no. <laughs> oh, she... She just fucking killed him. She just stabbed him in the neck. All because he wouldn't give up the D. No. 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 What they've done here with the lighting, how the, the blood shot on the, the headlights, so now everything's like illuminated in red, that's really cool. This is fucked up, but what they did with the lighting was really creative. What is wrong with her? <laughs> Look how fucking scary she looks. Look, she said, you, you're either gonna split me in two or I'm gonna split you in two if you- <laughs> RJ? Oh man, are they gonna kill Jenna Ortega? Haven't I like watched her be used like a fucking pin cushion enough? She's gonna go in like the Guinness world record of most number of stab wounds in a single film career. <laughs> Please, just give us a break. Please just give us a break. It's RJ. I woke up and, and he was gone. I, you don't think he left me, do you? Well, the band's still here. What is he wearing? He's probably just processing things, you know? Going back to bed. I feel bad if I hurt him. I don't want to break up. Well, that's not really an issue anymore, but even if it still was, you need to break up with him because he sucked. Please, I'm worried. All right, but I ain't getting in the middle of no more of this shit. So he's really going to look for him in whatever those underwear are. Because I don't know what the fuck that is, but he's choosing to explore the grounds. Just wearing that. What are you doing out here? Looking for my boyfriend? Have you seen my wife? No, sir. Oh, I think the husband knows. Deborah must be up to this, like, on the regular. Ooh. How do you think I've been surrounded by so many beautiful females my whole life? Oh, no. Uh... No. Oh, that is disgusting. RJ, you in here? I stepped on a nail. Come on out and help me, for Christ's sake. I'm pretty sure that if he was in there, that he would have come out already. I cannot get over how fucking ugly those underwear are. Like, he's got a, a pretty nice body, but the underwear aren't doing him any favors. What's that? What covered it? <laughs> Well, he's dead. There's another light down in the cellar. Can you go get it? No. Uh, uh, no, ma'am. My wife is not well. It's very dark and I'm worried she could fall and break her hip. Do I look like I give a fuck? Because I don't. No, if she, she better not go down to that fucking cellar. Ugh, fucking correct. Are you insane? Absolutely not. Oh God. No, Jenna, no. I, I need to go check my underwear. Ugh. Oh my god. This crazy bitch. What is wrong with her? Oh god. Found it! He's gonna shut the door or something. Something bad's gonna happen. I'm worried. See? He locked her in. Oh my God. Damn, that's 
girl can sing. One thing I do want to point out is Jenna's acting just now. And this is why Jenna Ortega is that bitch. Because she turned and she saw, and she, like, look of shock, an immediate tear came out. Oh, unparalleled. Unmatched. What is it, baby? It's not something. It's always something. It is always something. Whenever you hear a noise, it is always something. Oh no, Does this, is this man about to die with his ding dong hanging out? Oh my God, the milk thing says missing persons. It's probably people who have died on that farm. Everything okay, Pops? My wife, she's gone missing. She gets confused. About a firepower for a missing wife. <laughs> you ain't seen the wife. You need a shotgun for her. Want some help? Not for self, but for country, right? Look, look, uh, uh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Look at the size of that thing. This, it looks like a parking cone. <laughs> the shadow of his wiener just, just dangling back and forth. I wonder if that was real or if that was like a, like a Mark Wahlberg type situation where it was like a prosthetic. I wanna know how this bitch is moving around so silently and just like taking out all of these people single-handedly. Like when I'm 147, I wanna be this spry. Ew, can you imagine? Like you wake up and that's just looking down at you. <laughs> God. <laughs> Keep keep those inside. Keep those inside your, your your dress. Oh my god, this bitch got naked and is getting in bed with her. What? I say we each take a side of the perimeter. I only got the one light. I spent three nights face down in the rice paddy scanning for landmines and tripwire. Once a marine, always a marine. Uh, I don't think that's gonna matter in your case because the fact that you guys are by this deck probably means that he's about to shoot your ass with a shotgun and you're about to be eaten by an alligator. I cannot, I cannot. Oh God, like y'all, even my sleep paralysis demon is afraid of this shit. Ew. Oh my God, you know what it kind of looks, uh, what she kind of looks like, like with the, the light hitting her from the back and, and the white hair? She looks like that crazy motherfucker from um, the Wrong Turn movies, like the original. I haven't seen the new one, so I don't know if the new one's, if he's in there, but uh, he's crazy. He's like uh, kind of weird looking a little bit, you know? <laughs> That's who that looks like. Oh no. You got a partially submerged car? Mm-mm, mm-mm. Y'all remember when they were talking about Psycho earlier? What you doing on the way in there? What do you think? Trap. No, see, that is a trap if I ever saw one. Well, rest in pieces, I guess. Yes, find some fucking weapons, grab everything you can, strap up like you're Sarah fucking Connor, and then hide. Wait for them old bitches to come down there and then whack them. Ugh. Traipsing around, barely in the clothes, enticing my wife. Leave. Run. Run. What did I fucking tell you? I told you he was gonna get shot. Now he's gonna get eaten by the alligator. How is she even still sleeping with all the cocaine in her system? <laughs> yeah, girl. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh God, I like, 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 you know, you say, oh, that's my worst nightmare. Sometimes you see shit that you didn't even know was your worst nightmare, but then what, what previously was up there at the top of the list gets usurped. Like it's, it's over. Like this shit, no, 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 no. I'm not trying to deal with no 150 year old people chasing me down, trying to sit on my bone. Ugh. Look, 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 somehow she woke up despite having like 10 kilos of cocaine already in her body. Then she wakes up and what does she do? What's the first thing she does after screaming? More cocaine. Oh my goodness. Ma'am, be careful. You, no, push her, push her ass in. Oh. No, 167 years old or not, she would've got fucked for that. <laughs> You know what? You don't want my help? No problem. I was just trying to be nice. You need to knock her ass right back into that light. Let her be gator food. Move! You mean old ugly bitch. Oh, shit. Bitch. Uh. <laughs> Ugh. 
Oh, Miss Brittany. Oh, God. I mean, we knew that somebody was going to be gator food. But, like, how come Mia Goth was in the water for a fairly good amount of time earlier in the movie? But then Brittany Snow falls in the water, and within, like, ten seconds, she just gets annihilated by this gator. Was that the one? You know I don't like bombs. What does that mean? So she's like focused on Mia Goth then. Yeah, girl, you need a scrub. Ugh. Oh God, here comes Asper Cream and Polygrip. You need to run. <laughs> I got another. I don't want her. This one's different. She had something special. What does it mean? Can you at least let Jenna or take a go? Special. Since the first moment we met, you were the most beautiful woman I'd ever seen. Ooh, hey, hey, hey. 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 No, sis, that was like 400 years ago. Tell me I'm yours. You still want me. I swear to God, if I have to watch them have sex. <laughs> <laughs> what if my heart can't take it? Well, if your heart can't take it, then we got one problem resolved. <laughs> Uh, is Mia Goth underneath the bed? Yep, camera's panning down. She's underneath the bed. Ew, ew, ew. Again, very Texas Chainsaw Massacre, especially the new one. I, I don't, no. I don't need to see that. Show me the way to go home, go home. I'm tired and I wanna go to bed. Oh, thank God. Now, how did either one of them have the upper arm strength to literally stab through the rubber of a tire? What? Go rescue Jenna. Yeah, there you go. You know what? She's fine in the basement. Go back to where they were boinking on your bed and just take them both out. Please be quiet. Oh no, Jenna! I mean, they just randomly rent out their barn to hot young teenagers and young adults and then proceed to try and f them and when that doesn't work, they kill them and throw them into the lake for the gators. <laughs> what kind of ratchet setup y'all got going? Oh, Jenna. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> She's alive? <laughs> Did her final, like, death gasp give him a heart attack? Good, Jenna. F*** him up even in death. He's having a heart attack. I don't give a shit. Right, f*** him. Shoot her. Shoot, why? Why is this a thing? Why is this a thing in movies where they never just f***ing shoot him? Really, queen? Of course. No, 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 no. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, shit, that was, that was, <laughs> that was, <laughs> that was funny. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Y'all aren't inside. It's not self-defense no more. Take her ass out. <laughs> Oh, she's probably gonna back up and drive over her, probably. Yeah. All right, she got away, she got away. This pleases me, but all we saw was the guy. He just had a heart attack. We didn't confirm that he was dead. This bitch, still with the coca cane, like. Ooh, that is a gorgeous shot. That is beautiful. There she is, my beautiful little daughter Maxine. What? Lured into a life of sin. What the f We pray one day she'll find her way home to us. I am, I don't know what that meant. Hey boss, one of the boys uh, found this inside. What do you think is on it?
All right, so that was X. Look, I've watched some gross shit on my channel. I've watched gross shit in my personal life. The thought of waking up to the Crypt Keeper licking my arm in the middle of the fucking night is absolutely terrifying, disgusting, horrendous, absolutely not. I mean, it was a pretty good movie. I liked it, I enjoyed it. I thought it had a couple scenes that really scared the shit out of me. There was a lot of homages to other horror films that I that I noticed, like 100% Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I saw a couple Psycho references. I like like the vintageness of it. Now, I don't quite understand what the whole ending was with Mia Goth's character being the daughter of the preacher that kept playing throughout the film on the TV. I don't know if that was just supposed to be like, oh, this is why she does porn toe now, or if that was like a setup for a sequel, or if there's just some big underlying thing that I missed in the movie. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how Deborah Logan and her Crypt Keeper of a Husband managed to take out all of those people so easily. I mean, they did kind of, you know, show like that, you know, she didn't have a lot of strength, but also like she kind of had a lot of strength. But all I know is that her shooting the shotgun and flying like 50 yards back was some of the funniest shit I have ever seen. But yeah, let me know what you guys thought about this down in the comments and I will see you for the next one.